All right. Let's um. Oh, I don't want that. Let's grab a bite to eat. Hmm. Might need a bite more. I don't understand why it's. There we go. Um. You know what? Let me turn the volume down here a bit. The volume is a little too loud. Uh, oh, hey, what do you know? Some trees have been chopped. I'm just waiting for the leaves to fall. Ah, oh, man. Why did I ever have to decide to build next to a f forest? It was a terrible, terrible idea. I mean, I just, I never get any light. It's terrible. Okay, well. Okay. I'm gonna knock through this. I think what I'm gonna do. Ooh, cotton seeds. Um, I don't recall planting cotton there, but I guess I did. I thought I didn't plant anything there, so I wasn't sure what I was going to do. But I see that's not the case, so we'll plant that. It's all growing nicely, so that is good. Okay, now... This trick here. We're gonna pull this out. Two there is probably fine. And then we're gonna give this land back to the sea. As it was somewhat reclaimed. But is no longer needed. All this stuff in there. Now I assume at some point that'll that'll all refill. Really don't know for sure because I'm not sure how that works. Okay, then we're gonna run out to there. And fence that off. Go sweep right along there. Tuh, snow. Okay. Um we're gonna put one right there. Hey you goofy chicken, aren't you cold out in the snow? Okay, so I think what I've decided to do here is this. I'm going to dig all this dirt away. And I'm actually gonna I'm going to end up, let's see if the stairs are there. We'll go ahead and make whoops. Let's see my directions. We'll go ahead and make this a water channel. So that'll channel in water to keep the ground all fresh. And then we're going to do something along the same lines here. Kind of make that cow lose his mind. Like, wait, what's going on? The ground I am standing on is disappearing under my very feet. This can't be good. Like, eh, it really isn't, but... Yeah, there's nothing you can do about it, Mr. Cow. I mean, it is what it is. Oh, hey, I know I could dig the dirt from under a tree and the tree would fall. Huh. So, 
handy little trick. Wish I had known that a little sooner. Okay, now on this side, we're just going to well, we'll probably run in here and gather that stuff up. Okay, and then we'll just continue that right along. Now, I don't think that the water would ever flow to this point very well. Oh, wait. Wait a minute, how is the water... Oh, yeah, that would be right. Okay, we're going to have to find... some other means by which we can get this all properly watered. Because I don't think the water... whoops. <laughs> uh, wanted to put a fence there. And the torch on top. I don't think this water is ever going to properly flow all the way through to back here. So we'll probably have to put in something that'll get the water to actually flow there. But that's alright. You can always do that on a later date. Like, once we find something that we can transport water with. And then we'll just pull a few buckets full and dump it back there and... Okay, now that... Is all going to be just right. We'll leave a little archway under the stairs. If you don't even need that brick there. In. We may have to replace some of those when I actually put whatever I go with down. I think I'm doing slabs. But I don't think I can make a dirt slab. So it'll be either wooden or cobble. Hmm, where some wheat seed was. So, we'll end up with something running through there. I don't know what, though. Okay, now, evidently, I have too much of something, and I can't pick up all this dirt. Bloop, 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 bloop. Okay, um... Now, I've been told that, ooh, achievement unlocked, light it up. I've been told that torches are not bright enough to make plants grow, which I have no doubt about. Whoops, because they really aren't very bright. But I've also been told that torches are your maximum brightness, so I don't really know what to make of that. I mean, if that's as bright as it can be, how could you make something brighter than that to light plants up at night? Unless you just can't, which of course is completely possible. Okay, now we're going to do a little something like this here, where we Let's see what we have. We have three wide. So we will continue making this one three wide. And then on the end here, we'll have three wide. Though it'll, in actuality, only give me two wide for planting area. As there will be a fence running on it. Okay, I have some wheat seeds. No cotton seeds, though. Um, well, wheat's kind of my biggest, my biggest crop. So, I'll start that one right off. Planting a bunch of it. Yeah, 
and up to the yard we go. Do I have 99 else? I do. That is insane. Okay, well. Oh, there's a few empty spots in there yet. Jungle grass. Oh, hey, Mr. Dude out my window I just saw that disappeared. How is life treating you? Okay, yeah, we can't do slabs. So the question is, do we do slabs or do we do stairs? I think we do stairs. I think stairs will just end up looking a lot nicer. Um, okay. Um, ba -ba -ba -ba. Yeah, dude. I see you out there. I think we're going to come down to the basement and get a little work done down here. Let's see. I really want to replace... Any sort of a wooden implement I have with a stone one. So that means mining up stone. And I have plenty of dirt, so I have no worries about filling these holes all in. Maybe I'll just do that. At some point I'm going to have to do real serious mining. None of this easy... Oh, hey. I still have that. Um... I just really don't want to be stupid destroying my floor. Oh, there's a hole there. A hole I don't really remember making, but I know I did. Oh, hey, I could just leave glowstone on the floor, couldn't I? Just just like that. There's really no reason that I have to. Huh. That might be a nice way to actually light the basement up. With illumination from the floor. You could call it Flora Luminescence. Not that it would actually be anything like that at all, but... Oh, I found a good vein here. A mini miner! That's right, folks. I am now a mini miner. But this mini miner... Uh has to stop his mini mining. Because I have a basement to finish. Of course, it only gave me 17. Hardly enough to even... Hardly enough to even do anything. I don't know. I think if I'm going to do something like that, I'm going to use super glow glass. The amount of difference that it makes is just, it's night and day. Come on, let's jump in. And it's coming together. Slowly but surely it's getting there. I just really need a lot more stone. Stone that I don't have. Hi, dude. How do you guys keep getting in my yard? I've got 
a lamp right out there. I have lamps going all over my fence. You guys are supposed to be scared of light. In fact, I think light's supposed to kill you. But, uh, I guess it doesn't. And they, like, run to my door. They don't realize that I'm up in the air and they can't reach me. You know, I should see... Yeah, guys. Um. Oh, I didn't want to do that. I just want this. Can I make, like, a bow and arrow? A wooden bow. Wooden planks and cotton. I only have one piece of cotton. I want to make my bed first. A window flower box. Hmm. 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 Very interesting. Oh, then we have to see about how would I make an arrow? And iron? Oh, and a shovel? Oh, wait. What is this? An arrow? A build arrow? A dig arrow? A fire arrow? And a teleport arrow? Wow. I did not realize it was build arrows, but with this build, I don't understand. Uh, but no matter, it has to be iron material. I don't have any iron. Hey, you guys! Yeah. Why don't you attack each other? Aw, they're hugging. It's like super late. And see, they run to try to get to the darkness. And they can't. Except this guy seems to have. I mean, the sun's up. They should be burning. And he's going around just fine. Okay, let's go for a swim. Actually, you know what? We may not have to go for a swim. Whoops. Because I might be able to just build right out. I really have no idea how... That's probably more insufficient. Oh, I don't want to do that. All right. Um, I kind of went quiet for a long time there. I apologize. I um, completely was lost in the game, immersed in the experience. So, anyways, we are just. It's that's probably longer than it needs to be. Let's do that. And I'll throw this up real quick to be out to the same distance. And the same there. 
And honestly, I think we can leave that as is. Oh, I was gonna say, I hope I still have fence pieces. Cal's still doing a little jig over there. Alright, um... Obviously a lamp at the end. And we'll do a lamp right there. Torch. Why do I keep calling them lamps, the torches? Okay, and then I think... What I want to do... There's really no need to do this, but... Just so everything is nice and cohesive throughout. Shall do that. And then... I don't know how many more uh, wheat seeds I have. Oh, 21. Plenty of wheat seeds. We're going to plant this thing up with wheat. And we should be doing relatively good with the ground being wet. Seeing so if we got water running through nicely on both sides there. I have absolutely no cotton seeds. 37 pieces of wheat though. But I have six more. For the time being, and just because I have nothing else to plant here, we're going to plant more wheat. And now, for the... You know what? I can actually probably get away with doing this. Nice little wooden stairway up. Admittedly, pretty skinny stairway up. I may want to... <laughs> This feels a little sketchy. But I guess it'll do. I don't really need that one. Okay, then. Let's see. If we ever do get this finished. Two, three. We'll dig a path here. And now this, yes, should collide with that. Leave a path too wide in the center, where we won't plant anything. Maybe three, and then we'll have another two wide section here. Now this, oh, this all depends, of course, on our retrieving some sort of means of transporting water. Which at the moment, I don't have much. Can't even find iron. Which is pretty terrible. Seeing as how it's uh, important for pretty much everything. An underground water source. would be handy, but I really have no way of getting that anywhere around here, so it doesn't help. Technically, this doesn't actually have to be filled back in with dirt. It can stay a hole. I mean, if water is going to go here anyways, the water should fill it all up. Shouldn't do any harm. Make a nice little... And actually, this could turn out to be excellent for irrigation purposes if the water were to flow and fill this up. Which, honestly, I don't know how that would work. Because from what I understand, if you if you drop water out someplace, it pretty much just uh, 
kind of stays there. Uh, you know what, though? I think it will fill this. Just so it doesn't come back and, like, bite me later or something. There, there has to be some way of moving water. Man, this could be... It's a nice fence, but mobs can go in water, too. I don't have an axe on me, do I? No. A wooden sword, ahoy! Let's start chopping some trees down. Let's eliminate these trees. So we can get a little more light. Oh, there went one. Here comes another. Coming down quickly. Coming soon. To a console near you. The Epic Sega continues with the falling trees. Yes, you've seen it before. I have no idea where. In shows like, I have no idea what. Now, for the first time ever, it's really not the first time, you can play it yourself. You always actually could, but, you know, nothing's going to sell if you tell people, yeah, you could always do this, and you can still do it. I mean, pfft, that's not going to sell anything. You want to sell a product? You need to lie to the people. Tell them this is the first time ever. Make them feel like it's an exclusive and they'll willingly hand over fistfuls of cash. And you can pretty much laugh at them all the way to the bank. And I see a mob. And he is approaching. Or maybe he wasn't approaching. I don't know. And I just somehow kind of got stuck. We are skirting around. Saying, I honestly don't know where I can get in. Oh, hey, wait a minute. Yeah, no, I don't think I can get in there. Oh, is that how they're doing it? Because that actually works really well. Let's take these out. I doubt that's how these guys are getting in, but... I'm going to make sure. If it is, they can't use it anymore. There we go, suckers. No, I'm still gonna figure out how to get in somehow anyways. But I'll at least feel safe. Ready A forty cobblestone? Nah, -huh. bad. Let's throw ourselves together a stone a stone hoe. Yeah, I never be too good at that. It'd be too easy. Stone axe. Oh, let's do a stone pickaxe too. So we're gonna need that. Alright. All this all this material. There's nothing to do with it all. Um I don't even know I'm sitting on that flower. That random fence piece. 37 wheat. I have a feeling I can make a lot of something out of 37 wheat. Oh, hey. Now that I have cobble on me... Why don't I fix that? Because that just looks annoying. Fixed! Like a boss! I actually didn't need to be a piece of cobble there. Um. Okay, not sure why that. Put the torch out, as it should not have. But, as I've said, there are some bugs in this code. If any guru coders want to take it upon themselves, 
to refine and refactor my buggy code. Please feel free. Um, you know, I'll mention you in the credits. I'll say this person was a genius, and they fixed some of the bugs in my very imperfect, imperfect, imperfect. Wow, I can't talk today. My very imperfect code. I do find it kind of interesting that the signs are just floating here. I half expected them to fall apart when I dug the material out from behind them. And I just realized I did not have to fill cobble into that void. Could have stayed empty. Absolutely no ill effects. I wish those signs were a little more readable. But I guess what are you going to do? You know? I'm going to live with it. We're getting there. Slowly but surely we are getting there. I want to put a furnace under the stairs at some point. But of course I just used up all my cobble. So I pretty much can't do that now. Well, night has fallen. I think it is time for me to bid adieu. And, uh, yeah. Tune in next time. And we'll be, hopefully, harvesting enough cotton to finally make a bed. You know, we're only up to, like, the 13th episode of this. I still haven't gotten enough cotton to make a bed. It's really pretty sad, actually. But yeah, tune in then. And we'll be making some beds and having some fun in bed. Like jumping on them, people. Don't get the wrong ideas here. Thanks for watching, I'll catch you next time.